How does it feel, Gregor? I thought you'd say that. danger in this room with the star insignia it's just glinting over here the ruby and another suspicious magic circle with a tome at the center this seems to be some sort of journal is that Mardanius's hand I here begin my researches into this lowest section of the catacombs so far, I have found no evidence of an entrance to a lower level, but my intuition tells me there is one. My research has shown that the two central tombs lead to a secret lower part of the catacombs. I cannot open them, though. If I did so, hordes of skeletons would rise from their graves. I know the stench of an Ulthring's undead ambush bell when I smell it. I have found that opening all four outer tombs unlocks the two center tombs. However, as noted above, upon opening these tombs, hordes of skeletons will rise to slay the one that awakened them. I shall leave this journal here as a warning to others who dare to enter these parts of the catacombs. The further I proceed in this forsaken place, the more evil I sense is further on. I must find out what is down here. Maybe, Mardanius. Maybe not. Ready? There seem to be more treasures down here. one way through this room. We're just in another layer of the maze. I think I can see one of the central tombs. I think I can reach some of these skeletons from afar. Terribly well, Gregor. That's better.
This is an enormous chamber. Uh, I think the corner tombs may lay in this direction. Slightly frightening. I don't know if we'll ever be able to clear a room this size with all its undead occupants. Oh no, rat! I'm so sorry. Winged creature. We might have to stop to catch our breath soon. Ah, this must be an outside tomb. Maybe we can rest here for a moment. And maybe see what else there is to be done. We gained a level. Um, let's see. Uh, identify. Can we gain... Well, we're level 9. So we could get another level of identify, but still wouldn't be enough to identify the... Um, 
a level for identifying it that we need uh, for the axe that we're looking for. I suspect that is the axe um, we seek on behalf of the orcs. Um, and I'm not be able to level up again, I don't think, while I'm in the catacombs. So maybe I'll have a look for some other ability. Meteor Strike can't be improved. I could get a summon. We you know. Hmm. There's lots of interesting things around. I wonder what I would use. If I were going for, I think, a... Um, a character-based upgrade, I think it would probably be something like Ranger Sight from all the ranged attacks that Jeanne is doing, or perhaps uh, Enhanced No Creature would um, would kind of fit with her experiences lately. I mean, we might be able to pick up... Um, okay, we can pick up Great Repair. Um, an Orkham and stun. Repair or stun, which would actually be pretty handy, but I think we're going to go with I think the one that makes sense is Ranger Sight. Yeah, let's do that. How wonderful! Have. And as for our points, I think, what do we need? So we need 30 strength to wear this leather armour. Um, something to bear in mind. And... So probably... I kind of want to put, get everything up to at least 20 and pop the last two in strength. Yeah, I think that would be good. Let's do that. That should help. Okay. I think I'm ready, Gregor. Let's continue mapping out this place. The container appears locked. Sustain damage again.
Okay. We can open and close that tomb. Same for this one. Yeah, that was you. I didn't expect you to come from that direction. Let's find the center of this thing. A tomb. It's quite securely locked. Quite securely locked. There seems to be many layers of outer tombs in this area. A crumb of cheese and some minor magic. Oh, hello! This may have been one of the tombs that summons more skeletons. New Cord Armour. It looks fantastic. And it offers some protection, which is amazing. Because we had, hitherto we hadn't had any. So that's I'll take that. That may be so the, the, these may be the outer tombs. If you have to find the inner tombs in that case, 